My name is Zama and I'm a second year student here at Imperial College London and today I'm with my friend Fatima. Um, I hope you're all well. Um, I also, I'm also a second year medic living in London. Um, well we know that Imperial is a prestigious and well re world renowned university. Tell mm -hmm. us more Zama, why Imperial? There are so many reasons why I'm at Imperial now but I think most important was the course structure. This university maximises how much in hand, first hand experience you get with patients so that when you're on wards, it feels less uncomfortable and less of a foreign environment. So, for example, it's only been one year, but I've already had the opportunity to lead a GP consultation. I've already been to so many patients' homes and discussed like, their conditions with them. I've also got to listen to current doctors and consultants talk about the tips that they have like over them so many years of training and with all of that at our disposal and the way that the course has been structured it's honestly been amazing and South Kensington is just really nice <laughs> especially near winter time South Kensington is lovely um yeah so Fatima have you how have you found the workload here at Imperial and how have you dealt with it um, well, obviously, studying at Imperial, the workload is quite intense. There is a lot of work. Mm. It is challenging, but it's, it's never boring. I can assure you that, like, there's so many. The faculty are trying to develop um, methods, the best teaching methods constantly, um, mm. updating it, um, asking for feedback. Um, there's a variety of teaching methods used, lectures, seminars, placements, um, case, case and problem-based learning. Um, virtual reality sessions, film mm. sessions, like there's a lot. It never gets boring. Um, there's always someone to support you, whether that's your academic tutors, um, your classmates, the older years, people in your societies. There's always someone there. And yeah, that's lovely. Yeah. Um, but yeah, how have you found um, living in London, studying and living in London? I, as you know, I'm a born and bred Londoner. I've been here my whole life. So I'm biased. I think London is the best city in the world. But to anyone who isn't from London and is wonder, wondering what it's like coming here, I think the most important thing is, even though this place has terrible weather sometimes, and even though it can seem very fast paced and busy, we have a sense of togetherness, you know. There's a sense of community from where we're from, especially the imperial community. Um, and London is like an activity hub. Like, even if you want to do something crazy and fast-paced, there are places to go. There are so many activities. If you wanted to take it slow, if you wanted to, like, chill out while you're doing, having done so much work at uni, there are other places to do that as well. So when you get that kind of variety living here, it's absolutely, it's the best, it's the best of both worlds. Um, but one thing we do know at Imperial is that we have so many clubs and societies. Like, so Fatima, how have you been finding it, navigating it all? Imperial literally has so many societies, hundreds of clubs and societies for everyone. What's the like, number? Like 350, 360 something? <laughs> 380 million. There's, there's a lot. Uh, it's, and all I know is in the hundreds. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah, there's so many people that you can meet um there's amazing friendships and events um there's just there's just it's so much it's filled with happiness filled with friendship support like everything you need there's sports there's cultural there's uh religious there's mm. there's there's something for everyone um i'm also um a part of the somsot um i'm the public <laughs> and um, yeah, Zam is the president, so tell us more about <laughs> that and advice you have for prospective students. Yeah, as someone who's the president of a cultural society that we just started up this year, I mean, what we want to say as people who are Somali, for example, is definitely to people who don't feel as though they might have a place, they have this preconception that Imperial, as such an amazing and elite university, don't feel as though they have a place in a space like that like me and Fatima are here to are, to, are here to explain that there is no such thing as an as an ideal student here we come in so many breeds we come in so many from so many backgrounds and the most important thing is is that there is a place for you here because 
first of all, some stock is is definitely a home for anyone that wants to come. But there are yeah. so many students on campus that you will find someone who has the same passions and the same mindset as you. So make sure, especially when you come here, you have that positive mindset and that drive to get through your work and to make the best friendships that you're going to have in your life. So yeah, yeah. just to wrap definitely. it up. <laughs> and definitely, but yeah, we hope you consider applying here. There's so many mem- memories to be made, friendships to be made, mm. and good luck with your applications. And we hope to see so many of you here next year. Yeah, Bye. see you guys. See you.